Okay guys, so this is my Kindle Oasis review. Now I've only had the Kindle for about two or three days now. And as you can see, I've purchased a cover for it. Isn't that pretty? I got this on Amazon actually, and the brand is um, Moco, or maybe I'm being an idiot here and looking at it wrong. Oh, or OV. I don't know. It's very hard to tell. Um, yeah, it looks like it's. Ovoe, but um, I got it on Amazon. They sell a lot of them. This one is a full bodied, so it does cover the entire thing, and it's really pretty. And you see this little indent here that's the battery, it's still in there. Um, but yeah, this is the case I got, and it is super flexible and it does hold it very nicely. Um, I often actually use this, the Kindle. I fold it this way. I am right-handed, but I'm also a little ambidextrous, so I will hold the Kindle like this, and this is how it gets held. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to just click on a random. The Audible is very nice. You use Bluetooth headphones for that. Um, so I'll just go ahead and I'll click on this Kindle Oasis opening. And it'll tell me right away. I can mark it as Goodreads. Tells me about the time I can read it. Some uh, popular highlights. So they do pre-highlight for you to tell you how many people have highlighted things. And to highlight it, you just hold down the button. And it highlights it just like that. And you can make a note. You can click to highlight. You can make a note. You can share it. You can actually look up what the word means, which it's done already for me because I've set that up. Um, and it tells me exactly what this is. Um, I don't know if that's a little weird looking because of the way that the thing looks. But um, you can turn the page by just clicking it and it'll go through. Or you can use these buttons. One is drag, one is forward. And no matter which side you use it on, you can flip it over and do the same thing and at the top button you can switch them too if you go to your settings so you just roll it down oops I'm sorry one handed is a little bit of a trick but you just roll this baby down or click up top sorry I'm used to an android phone so um, click the home button go to settings oops oh I clicked download it by accident but click settings, then you can go ahead and click to all settings and it'll give you a list of settings. Now, for those of you who do like the black, the inverted text, which is what I have going on right now with the black background and the white letters, I find it easier to read that way. You can actually go to um, accessibility and it'll show invert black and white. Okay, so just let you guys know ahead of time, hit the back button. This thing is super fast, by the way. It doesn't look like it because I'm having trouble touching the buttons. My fingers are really dry. Um, you can add parental controls. Um, the dictionaries, you can change the languages. Yeah, you can add restrictions. Kindle free time. Um, these are the restrictions you can add to the cloud. Or you can add a restriction to the cloud. Access to Goodreads, web browsers, so on and so forth. Um... I like the Kindle free time thing, but I would never let my son play with this because it's way too expensive, guys. Um, I actually got this one as a refurbished, and it is without ads, but it costs about the same amount of money it would cost for a full, regular one that was refurbished with ads. It got it, like, kind of on sale. Um, this is not a sponsored video at all, whatsoever. I'm just letting you guys know how this goes. But yeah, it's just two adults, two children. You can airplane mode it and Wi-Fi networks, delete permanent passwords, Bluetooth to my Kindle. Now, if you pair a Bluetooth to this, which I have, it is my um, Anchor Slim Buds, which you can also find on Amazon. They cost about uh, $36. They're water resistant, also not sponsored, by the way. Um, 
and they have a really good battery life too. Once you pair it, it'll automatically pair to this. So when you turn it on, turn on your Bluetooth headphones once you've paired it, um, anytime that you turn on your Bluetooth headphones, it'll automatically pair to this. And then you can go ahead and click on your, um, you know, I just completed this book. And, you know, obviously it says that I don't have this connected to a Bluetooth right now. But if I did, it would just start right up. Um, another cool thing is you can go over here to these little, why is it? Okay, so you obviously see it is very I gotta have, it's hard to explain, you gotta have like texture on your fingers. And I just took a shower, so I do not have texture on my fingers at all. Oh, come back to me. This is the first time I've ever actually used the YouTube button, pressy things. Oh, you know what? That's why. See, that tells you I haven't used it very long. But you can come up top and just click on that. You can shop the Audible stores, you can add bookmarks and notes, and if you go back home and you go ahead and click on it again, you can go down, read my library, my reading lists, Kindle store, audiobooks. You can enable Goodreads. I like Goodreads. They have the Kindle Free Time Vocabulary Builder, which is really awesome, um, and it'll also give you flashcards and things of that sort, an experimental browser, um, which is as they said experimental so uh, I guess you can open up these pages here so let's go ahead and click on one I've never done this before so let's click on Google oh look at how cool that is it's it's very old school looking but you can still go on Google and you can also um, attach this to your Facebook and Twitter by the way um, just to give you a little heads up there and uh, another cool thing about this little uh, Kindle right here is that you can see all that you've downloaded, but it also comes with the free user guides, so they're not wasting any paper, and I really like that a lot. Look at how fast that is compared to the previous Kindle Paperwhite, or even, I've never had the, pre uh, the previous Oasis, but look at how fast that is, like that is crazy like crazy crazy oh my gosh I can't even believe how ridiculousness that is I've never I'm obviously I'm quite a newbie at this kind of ordeal but I did have a Kindle Paperwhite for quite some time so this is awesome you can always change these little things here to click to go to what page of the titles you've got going on there Another cool thing you can do is click these little three icon buttons and it'll tell you, you can choose the chapters, play audible, you never have to leave your home screen, remove from device, bookmarks and notes, um, and it'll give you the hours and who it's narrated by and that. So this weekend I'm just a quick little review or an overlook of it. So this is what it looks like so far. And so far, so good, guys. I mean, really, this is... I am very impressed by this. And this cover is to die for. And it's very, um... It's very sturdy. I'm quite impressed by this cover. And now I'm not afraid to scratch the back up because, you know, it's just a cover or whatever. It cost me $14.99 on Amazon. So just go on Amazon, guys, and look around. And I'm telling you, get while the getting's hot because... These things are flying off the shelf. I mean, they were out of stock of the original that I was going to get. And then um, once it came around to getting the uh, Kindle, I ended up getting a different one. But they were 90% out of stock and it was only an hour later. So if you guys really are interested, I highly suggest go ahead and get one. It is worth the money trust me. Especially if you're an avid reader and you love Audible, this is the way to go. This is, once again, like I said, not sponsored by Audible, Kindle, Anchor, or basically any brand names I've mentioned. Oh, and the Bluetooth. You can also hook it up to a Bluetooth speaker so you can listen to it that way. Or, um, 
you know, it, it just has a lot of really interesting features. I'm still kind of learning the tricks and stuff, but I will come out with a video of tips and tricks on this. But for now, this is just my quick review, and I give this a trillion thumbs up for you bookworms and you, you little reading nerds, okay? Alright guys, thank you, and I will uh, talk to you later. Bye-byes.